Hi guys. See drama greets you. Han Ting thought everything was going according to his plan. However, after explaining Dong Yang's current resources and strong background, he was still disappointed when Ji Xing ruthlessly rejected him. After leaving Dong Yang, Su Zai Zhao and Ji Xing reflected on the generous conditions that Han Ting had offered. Su Zai Zhao was still regretful and suggested that Ji Xing reconsider. He proposed that they could use Dong Yang as an experimental base. If their project succeeded, they could accumulate experience and channels before starting anew. Ji Xing was dissatisfied that Su Zai Zhao was so easily persuaded. This was their first collaborative project, so how could they give up so easily? Han Ting had made thorough plans. Although Ji Sheng had not yet agreed to join Dong Yang, Han Ting remained confident. He believed that with a little patience, Ji Sheng would face setbacks in her startup and eventually embrace Dong Yang. Back at home, Ji Sheng carefully examined the dense notes on Han Ting's proposal that she had seen on the table earlier in the day. She found that some of Han Ting's suggestions were indeed very constructive, identifying even the smallest flaws. Tang Song suggested to Han Ting that he should confess his feelings earlier, as secret admiration is inefficient for adults. However, Han Ting reminded him that this was not just a matter of emotions. He got Ji Xing's 3D printing project was excellent, and that Ji Sheng had great talent in software development. As long as the right opportunity arose, this promising investment could be completely successful. When Ji Xing's girlfriends heard that she had her own studio they all sent flowers to celebrate. Su Zai Zhao was dazzled by so many beautiful girls and each of them had prepared a gift for the opening, making the office lively and cheerful. At noon Su Zai Zhao invited a few girls to a barbecue, busying himself by the grill and leaving a deep impression on Ji Zing's friends. Ji Zing's friend Lu Linjia mentioned that she had a blind date the next day and invited Ji Xing to accompany her to avoid any awkwardness. She added that the guy worked in medical equipment, which might be useful in the future. Ji Xing was tempted and agreed to go. Coincidentally, the blind date was Han Ting's nephew, a distant relative. Han Ting's aunt insisted that her son go on the date and, fearing he might run away midway, had Han Ting personally monitor him until the date was over. Ji Sheng arrived a bit late and ran into Han Ting directly at the hotel. Just having rejected him the day before Ji Sheng deliberately claimed she was there to meet an investor out of spite. Han Ting who was just making a call in the corridor greeted Ji Sheng and then continued towards the private room, only to find that they were in the same room. What a coincidence. Han Ting sarcastically remarked that he got Ji Sheng was there to meet that investor. Tu Xiaoming quickly tried to help Ji Sheng get closer to Han Ting, mentioning that Ji Sheng had been looking for investors recently and had met many unreliable clients, including one particularly shameless one who tried to poach her. Tu Xiaoming was describing Han Ting without realizing he was the one she was talking about, while Ji Sheng sitting nearby turned green with embarrassment. Lu Linjia didn't like the blind date guy. Back at home, her girlfriends were curious about the type of man Lu Linjia liked, given her high standards. Blushing, Lu Linjia said she preferred someone gentle and considerate. After listening, Tu Xiaoming gossipingly summarized that Lu Linjia's ideal type seemed to match Ji Zing's boyfriend's type perfectly. Xiao Yichen brought a lunchbox to Ji Zing's office. Everyone in the office praised Ji Zing's handsome boyfriend. After eating the lunch made with love, Ji Xing was even more motivated to work hard. This was her first startup and she had to plan well. The software prototype was taking shape, but the printer had not yet arrived. Su Zai Zhao suggested renting a printer first instead of buying an expensive new one. Thanks for watching. Mention in the comments if you are waiting for the next episode.